Welcome to the Gospel of Luke. We're at Luke 15 today, verses 13 and 14. The lost son. Let's see what happens. He's got, he's been given his inheritance, and here's the reading. Not many days after, the younger son gathered all together, journeyed to a far country, and there wasted his possessions with prodigal living. But when he had spent all, there arose a severe famine in that land, and he began to be in want. So we're just taking the first phase here again. The father separated to him his stuff at his request, and here's what we see. It wasn't too long. Boy, he didn't let the moss grow on anything, did he? He gathered up all of his stuff. He goes away, and this, this is a foolish behavior, right? He goes to a far place. He's going far away. He wants to be far away from his father's home. He wants to be way away from him. I am not near the father's home. Far away, and he takes his stuff, and what does he do? wastes his possessions with prodigal living. He's wasting his possessions. He's just wasting his money. He's just burning it. He gets all these friends, you know, and, and we'll, we'll talk about that. Uh, but he's got that kind of friend that comes, you know, when you've got extra money to burn, that's what's going on. So he is far away. He's wasting his money. He's living like there's, I'm a rich man. But guess what? He's living like he's a rich person. But uh, it's interesting what's now going to happen. You know, the trouble is you can't really look at the future and understand the future. So when he had spent all, there arose a severe famine in the land. So he, he takes his money. He burns this money over a short period of time. He burns it all. It's all gone. Now it's gone. And now that it's all gone, suddenly there's a big famine. And now he can't hardly scrape together two, two coins to buy something. He, he's suddenly without all this wealth. It's just gone. It's just been used up. And that's the situation we're going to leave him in this morning. Boy, you know, predicting the future, I guess, wasn't his uh, strong suit, was it? Let's pray. Father in heaven, moving far away from our Father's house, a lot of people have moved far away from your house. They knew you, they were in your home, but they've kind of gone out over the hill and they're doing crazy stuff and they're living like there's no judgment day and yet, Lord, there is. And so, Lord, we hope this would not be our case or the case of any of our loved ones. And yet, Lord, we pray, work for us, help our hearts to be right, help us to have an eye to the future and not just the moment. So you will help us. We know you will. We thank you for hearing our prayers for our loved ones that are not in the kingdom where they should be right now. In Jesus' name we pray. So friend, watch watch out. The Lord of heaven is watching over you. and uh, But you may need to go through sometimes some intense pieces to get your head on straight. And I think we're going to see some more of that tomorrow morning. Friend, God bless you in all that you do today.